So I'm sure you guys have seen this video. And my question is why? Okay, let's say you have a racial preference. Okay, what the fuck is the point of talking about it? And in the aggressive fashion that you chose, you have you chose first of all to make an entire video about it, and you have got a line of you, and a hundred percent of you, one hundred percent of you are running toward the white girls and away from the black girls. This obviously puts down black girls. Like, you're gonna pretend it doesn't, you're gonna play dumb, but you know exactly what the fuck you're doing. What is the point? I don't get what you're trying to accomplish. And let me put forth this question. Do you know that shutting the fuck up is an option that's available to you? I'm starting to think a lot of people don't know that they actually can shut up. They don't have to post every thought that they have in their head. I'm really concerned that some of you guys don't realize that. That you think you have to say fucking everything you think. You don't. I think that's an important thing that we need to internalize. That we can actually keep some shit to ourselves, especially if it's going to put down a group of people for no fucking reason. Not coming at this person at all for making this comment. Don't respond to it, whatever. But are we just going to act like there isn't a whole trend where people are doing this? <laughs> people shit on black women all the time, and then they say it's just their preference when it's borderline racism. I'm one man. I can't defend all of them. But... I'm I'm trying. I love me some queens and I'm really trying to shed some light on how beautiful they are. Uh, I like brown skin, no spray tan. And when it comes to melanin, I'm a big fan. Most clown me cause I'm a white man that likes black girls, not just because I can. Uh and let me tell you something here. I like them dark and juicy, but like something that it don't come near. I like them strong, loving, and independent. And when they take care of themselves, it's transcendent. Don't amend it, uh. And let me meet your mama. I'll show where I can cook, and then I won't start no drama with your brothers and sisters. Cause I know for sure you got them. They're protective over you, but I won't start no problems. I learned to do your hair just like your mama used to. I'll cook you good food just like your daddy do. I'll take care of you, yeah, that's what I be doing, uh. And the loyalty. A black woman won't love you normally. She'll wanna make you think that she hates you But she just wanna try and take care of you Uh, yeah Love me some queens I cannot stand when I post some stuff about black women And then I always get some people in my comments being like Well, you're not even black, so maybe you should just stay out of it Like, first off, I'm mixed Second off, huge part of this page is uplifting black women So either get with the program or just get the fuck off the page No one's talking about the color. It's the face. No one was talking about the color. It's the face. The point is, they change their facial features to look like a black woman. And that gets set as a beauty standard instead of where it really comes from, actual black woman. Uh, okay, okay, I'm admitted. I'm just in love with these melanin women. Don't mind me just uh, trying to post a video. TikTok keeps taking down. Bro. Read this. Read this. Read this. And this. And this. This too. Oh, and another one. Yet another one. And this. And this. And this. Got anything more to say? Or anything to back that up? Or are you just gonna try to be edgy for no reason? This is very invalidating to the experiences that black women have to go through. You have the audacity to say they're privileged. You have the audacity to say they have more privilege than me? Disrespect. Horn. Einhorn is a man! Seriously? You have nothing better to do with your time than to come on this platform and randomly bash and disrespect black women. Why? Who hurt you? Seriously, who hurt you? I'm sorry, whatever happened to you that led you to this place where you feel like you need to bash black women for the approval of others, for the likes and the clicks on this app? 
there's so much hatred on your page. You know, if you're gonna be controversial, at least try to be funny, and you're not. Um, I wanna spread some positivity, uh, and specifically to black women. You're awesome, you're beautiful, we love you, and you don't deserve this shit. So this account posted an unconfirmed rumor, and I just wanna show you some of the comments. So Megan always gets some really ignorant comments from her haters. But there were two ideas in multiple of these comments that, you know, really bothered me. Number one, they're like, well, this is a woman saying protect black woman. Yeah, and what? Protect black woman is not a conditional statement. It means the way society treats black women is that they are unprotected. A black woman getting drunk does not mean she's not to be protected. and does not mean her statement about protection is not valid. Secondly, she's an alcoholic. You clearly have no experience with alcoholics if you think this. We all know alcohol is a depressant, right? And sometimes when you get drunk, you might get a little angry. And that's okay. Happens to everyone. Not to mention, she's gone through some really traumatic things in the past few years. People forget that Megan Thee Stallion is human. She's not perfect. And you shouldn't expect her to be perfect. Need I repeat myself? New challenge alert, look at your last 10 videos. And if you're not black, but most of your videos are using the sound of a black woman's voice, <laughs> you're probably racist and have no personality. This is what I wanna see. 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 This is what I wanna see.